Hello, and welcome to my video on how to unlock an Android phone with a broken screen. Now, if you're watching this video, you probably already have an Android phone, and you're probably already aware that there's this great security feature where you can use a uh, pattern to lock your phone so that anyone who picks it up or steals it is unable to unlock it if they don't know the pattern, and therefore they cannot get to your precious, precious data. But what happens if you somehow break the screen on your phone so that you can't draw the pattern to unlock it because the screen just doesn't respond anymore? How are you supposed to get to your data in order to get it off the phone before you get a new one? Well, let's get even more specific, actually. Let's say you go to the Batu Caves in Malaysia, where I was recently. Fantastic, incredible place. But don't do what I did if you go there, which is to slip on a patch of wet bat guano while taking photos with your phone. And then uh, when you fall on your butt on the rocky ground, you smash the phone into the rocky ground and your beautiful Sony Xperia phone that previously looked like this ends up looking about like this. Oh, not too bad, you say? Well, no, look closer. Yeah, the corner is all smashed up there. There's uh, cracks all across the screen. Oh boy. Let's see what happens if we try and turn it on. Okay, well, uh-uh, nothing. It does not respond at all. Great, so how am I now supposed to unlock this phone to get my pictures of the Batsu Caves and other stuff that I wanna download off of it before I have to go out and pay for a new phone? Well, fortunately, there is a solution. On Android phones like this, that are model uh, software 3.1 and later, supposedly, you can use a uh, USB mouse, like this little travel mouse that I've got. Now, the problem you have, though, is that a USB connection off of that mouse is not the same as this kind of USB connection that's on the phone. So, how do you solve that problem? Well, fortunately, there are these little devices that are easy to find. Just go to Amazon.com or any other website and search for USB OTG, that is USB on the go. And you will find that there are lots and lots of little uh, connectors. They range in price from a couple of bucks up to 10 bucks, you know, get whatever you want. I spent a little extra and got this really kind of cool one here that in addition to having a USB port has uh, card reader ports and, and other such stuff anyway, but it all connects up to here and it all connects to the phone. So let's hook this up to the phone and see what happens. All right, so bear with me for just a second. Well, I do this one-handed. All right, get in there, there we go. Okay, so now it's plugged in and hey, look, the light on my device came on, so that's nice. That means something must be happening. And now power up the phone, great. And now with the mouse, hey, look at that. That is magic. So now, click the mouse, and boom, the phone is unlocked. Anytime you click the mouse, it's the same as touching on the screen. And that is how you unlock an Android phone with a broken screen. I hope this video helps. Have a great day.